Hello everyone, welcome to episode 2 of season 4. We're going to kick off with the Euros games against Portugal and then Italy. And these are big games for us, we have to win them. Uh, I'm just going to show you the group here, you can clearly see it down here. Um, we win this game, we put ourselves into a good position, we beat Italy, we're practically true. Let's see how we get on. I also have a cup of tea here to, well, to drink. I, I don't know why I said that. <laughs> oh, I'm so bad at commentating. Yeah, it's a little hot, but it tastes nice. Let's hope that uh, we're on fire in this game. That was so bad. Oh, Jesus Christ, I'm going to stop talking. I'm sorry for any pain or any trauma I've caused. Any of the viewers who just saw that. Robinson's true. Good goal. Very good goal. That's a brilliant ball. And oh, can we do anything with this at all? No, no, wait, 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 whoa, 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 what the fuck was that? I said shoot, and he stops, turns around, and then turns into the goalkeeper? Mm. I'm going to call match fixing. I'm not going to get too mad, as I already have a fucking headache. But that is match fixing. I would be a lot angrier if uh, my head wasn't pounding already. Also, I passed that to Robinson, and I just tapped it to burn. Oh, I don't start EA. I don't have the brain power for this. We have a chance in the box. If we can get it to someone useful. Oh, okay. Decent save. All right, we'll, sh we'll commentate the corner. Though. We won't score from it. We never do. Okay, but that was out of play. Okay. Oh, good ball. Hope oh, Femi's true. Let's hope he doesn't fuck up like last time. Just hit it. Just hit it. They take so long to do what you want them to do. And it's not Oba Femi's fault. It's the code in the game. There's a delay on every input that you put in. Whether it's intentional, whether it's a bug, or whether it's just a shitty Frostbite engine that they're using. It, it For a sports game, or any game to be fair, you, you can't handle delays in the game. It's the same with fake shots. There's such a delay. Any input really, there's always some sort of delay with it. And it's in the code. You can tell it's baked into the fucking game. Oh, that's a good pass. Will Brown finish? Of course he won't. Oh my god, he did. Okay. Alright, wow. Fair enough. Good shot. We're 2 0 up. Very good goal. I was not expecting him to score that. Okay, this puts us into a good position for the Italy game, which I think they're winning 1 0 against Turkey. Let me do Duffy. And then where are we going? Where are we going? I think this attack is broken down, unless there's a screamer coming out of nowhere from Brown. No. Look, at least we kept the ball. Just. Oh, God. As long as they don't have the ball, they can't score. Oh, well, they can't. Wait, no goal. Oh, my God. Oh, Femi, finish that. You sexy piece of shit. You love to see it. Oh, but Femi is starting to get good. Now, he, he was okay. Right? Don't get me wrong. He was okay. He wasn't bad. He was okay. Now he's starting to get good. Great finish. Great turn, actually. That that turn was fantastic. That's something that Robinson would do. And we all know how important Robinson is for the Ireland team. Obafemi is getting up there. Obafemi with another great challenge. I was expecting to get anywhere with that, but great challenge. Oh, nearly a good good uh, pass there to Robinson. Right, we're going to leave uh, Obafemi on because he's been fantastic. Robinson's been his usual self. We're going to give Hobbin his Ireland debut. We're going to take... Carry the off for Cullen. Who else? Maybe McDermott for Randolph as we're training up. Usually I'd sim it, but uh, I I, I kind of want to just make sure that we win this. And I'd probably do the same with the Italy game. I just want to make sure that we're definitely going to win. Before I, uh, I, I sim it. But you never know with EA. We all know what they're like. Oh, that's a foul. Oh, this is a, this is a promising attack. Hobbin finishes his first goal. Yes, he does. Hobbin is literally his first touch. Ends with a goal. Who else but Hobbin? What a hero. And with that, we are going to jump to the result. Nine minutes to go. There's no way we can concede four goals. And it finishes like that. That's a great victory for us. Italy won against Romania and Belgium played Turkey. So I got the two opposition mixed around. However, we are on top by one point. Next game is Italy. We have to win. 
And in fact, that would actually qualify us. Yeah, that would guarantee us qualification. A draw puts us in a, a good position, but we could still lose. But a win guarantees us uh, qualification. It guarantees us at least second place finish. All right, this is the team that we're using to play against Italy. They're the only team to beat us in this group. And I have a feeling that they're going to beat us here as our players are a bit tired. So I have to do a little bit of rotation. Uh, I'm not entirely confident with the squad I've gone with. But Hobbin does start his first ever Ireland match. And does anyone else? Um, no, no. Every, every other player has started. I'm a little nervous for this. But remember, it's not the end of the world if we lose this. Because we still have Romania to play, which is a guaranteed three points. And we have Belgium. So practically true as it is, but I would like to get it over and done with here. Even a draw would put me in a, a good result. Or a good spot, sorry. Bad English. All right, about to start the game against Italy here. I wonder if I just put a bunch of biscotti and uh, pizzas around the pitch. Will uh, the Italian players get distracted and try and eat them and leave the goal open? Haha, <laughs> top quality jokes here on the Elite Head Players channel. Been some serious counter-attack from us. Oh, but Cullen, uh, Cullen has a terrible shot. Like my strikers were nowhere where they needed to be there. And now these uh, spaghetti-loving players have a chance to score. No. Nope. Not manning with a great... Okay, no, apparently not. No, apparently that's not our ball. We were never going to win that. Okay, that's interesting. Great challenge. Can we get the ball clear? Can I switch to a player that's worthwhile? Yes, we can. Okay, grand. Adam Ida has been set free... I think go yeah no we were never scoring from that no one would have scored from that angle not without sliders oh whoa, whoa, whoa what the fuck was that okay here's Randolph just passing it straight to them get ready to set either true or don't all right that's half time I thought it would have had more time for a counter-attack there but not much has happened. It hasn't been great, let's be fair. It, it's not great. Belgium aren't even a, a threat to me at the moment. They really aren't. If they draw that, we're guaranteed to go through. With a draw. Oh, that's a good pass from Hobbin. Right, let's just hold on to it. Let's not do anything. Retard it. Either. I will sub you off. I will sub you off. Right. Obafemi is clearly better. Sorry, Ida. It's You know it's the truth. All right, I want Hobbin to score here. Ah, fuck it. He can pass it instead. Okay, maybe... maybe she, oh, penalty! Hobbin has an assist for that penalty. Well, great work from Ida. Yeah, Connie's clapping as well. He knows it's the right decision. Let's see what... what I assume it's handball. Ah, that's not a penalty. Don't care, though. It'll send me uh, through. This goal will confirm me being... Top of the group. Or it wasn't a penalty anyway, let's be fair. It was not a pen. Should have scored it. Was not a pen. And uh, that was an awful header. Oh god. Three changes. Obafemi, Brown, and Duffy on for a Hobbin, Cullen, and Egan. That's a good pass. If you can make it Brown. No. No, it just didn't go where I wanted it to go. It was in the wrong direction. The fact that Brown even got close is uh All right, we're in their box again. Have a shot. Yeah, that was never going in. Obafemi and the others, I just couldn't see an open the pass to them. There's Obafemi going through. Oh, that's probably... Oh, no, I was going to say it's the best chance we've had, but I think we've had a one-on-one -on -one that we missed with Ida, I think. It might be bullshit, and I, I thought we did. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's completely slipped through. All right, Lenahan, I don't know why you're a captain, but you're going to have to try to stop that. All right, good work, Randolph. Oh, we have a chance. Obafemi, if Ida can get into the position, which it doesn't look like he feels like it. Oh, go alone, Obafemi. Great goal. Obafemi has finally come of age. He is good now. Well, I mean, he was good before. He's he's playable in... Uh, I don't know what I want to say here. He's he's not great, though, is he? He's, he's good. He's very good. Where before he was okay. There we go. There you go. He's very good now. Rather than okay like he was. Uh, so that's... Uh, what's that? Like his fourth or fifth goal in the qualification campaign. That's quite good. 
Right, they have a free kick here. Uh, there's about a couple seconds left. Let's see what they decide to do. Yeah, they're obviously going to have a shot. That was awful. What a waste. And that is us through. We're going to the Euros. That was, um, that was actually a very good qualification. We still have two games left, but I mean, I'll probably sim them as we're already through. And that game was, wasn't important to us. In fact, let's check the group right here. I'm actually curious to see what we've done. No, I can't check the group. It's in the calendar. Oh, here it is. So Belgium... Oh, fuck's sake. Why did it do that? So Belgium are... What's the... 10 points off us? Yeah, they're, they're out of it. So are Portugal. Although they have a game in hand, but they're practically gone. So yeah, we're, we're through. I can say I can safely sim Romania and Belgium. For anyone wondering, I bet Finn Harps one nil, and we have Sevilla in the Europa League quarterfinals. I also have a youth report. Uh, we have Thomas Monaghan here, looking very very good. Jordan Quigley, uh, yeah, he was too low rated, and he's obviously not good enough now. And the rest are fine. I mean, they need to be a bit higher rated, but yeah, they're fine. In terms of our actual monthly report, uh, yeah, no, they're not great, are they? Gilmore is fine, but uh, the other two aren't great. Right, this is the game that we're playing, or the, the game, this is the team that we're playing against Sevilla. Uh, Duffy does not feature, but Moran is taking his place. Ottawa's on the right, Arizero is at left back, or sorry, right back. Oh, that's a great ball. Hobbin, you have to finish this. Yes, okay, that's a great start. Uh, I didn't uh, I didn't say anything during kickoff, and I realise that now. But anyway, you can see the start of the game, we just basically scored. That's essentially what we did. We just passed it around, and then what a pass that was. Oh, that's a tasty finish. Well done, Hobbin, and Murray, of course. Oh, they're true. Oh, oh they missed. Holy shit, how did they miss that? They should have scored. Could be one all. Potential good ball. Very good ball. Ah, oh, we were felled. Ref, how is that not a pen? Or at least a free kick from outside the box. We were felled. He was all over me there. Right, that should be half time now. Uh, EA? EA? There we go. Okay, I was getting scared. Okay, half time, one little up. Very, very uh, impressive. If we can finish, if I take a 1 0 right now, I really would. But they had a chance to score. I know, they had two chances to score where they probably should have scored. But we got away with it. There's only so long I can keep that up. That's a good ball. Potential for offside, but for some reason they didn't bother giving it. Great save from Loom. Oh, that's a great goal. Um, who was it? Arizero should have probably blocked that since the ball was on the ground and he was on the ground. Oh, we're not going to question the, the collision in... In FIFA, it doesn't really exist. Oh, off the crossbar. I was not expecting to do so well. That's a corner. Uh, I'll, I'll take a corner. Not that we'll do anything with it. I don't know why I say I take a corner. I don't score from corners. Hit it. No, instead you take too long. Again, talk about the delay. EA, please fix it. I know you're not going to do it for this game, but for future games. Just go back to the gameplay from FIFA 15 or 16. That was peak FIFA. Possibly even 17. I did like 17 a lot. Alright, they have a chance here. The block, but we need a rebound. We need people on the rebounds. Okay, it's a goal kick as well. I've also noticed that Slobbert's on a yellow, so we're going to take him off from McGrath. And my phone went off. Every time I record, my phone goes off. Fantastic. Oh, 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 oh for fuck's sake. I just couldn't get near him. That was, I would say, bullshit, but he was just so fast. How are you that fast this late into the game? My players can't even fucking run in a straight line properly. Well, saying that, Duffy's doing his best. Just hit it. Oh, good save. Off the post. I don't want to be negative or anything, but... I think you're watching the end of the Europa League campaign for this season. I did, in the back of my head, think that we would probably win it. Because we were always just getting away with it. Just about getting away with it. But going away to Sevilla... I can't see it. I know it's only a one goal deficit, but I cannot see it. I can't see us winning. Not even if we end up scoring here, which we won't. Because that was a foul, but 
Like you even injured them and nothing happens. Like the, the game, the game was. I don't want to say against us, but it feels like they they're a bit biased. It's just the, the way the game goes. You know that they have patterns for code and all that, and it just felt like that. But yeah, uh, we drew with Shelburne in the league, but we don't really care about the league. Right, this is our last attempt at trying to secure something from this game, as we need two goals if they have two away goals. That's a, a false nine, and uh, yeah, it's an all youth midfield. Uh, I don't know how I feel about that, but we have to give it a shot. Oh shit, yeah, the game kicked off. I, I keep doing that. Uh, I was just daydreaming. So uh, that's why I missed it. But yeah, uh, we have 90 minutes-ish to try and get something out of this game. I might even get something straight away if we're lucky. Hit a coin. Nah, nah. He was the wrong person. Uh, should have been hobbing on that side. That's not who I passed it to. I mean, that's a great goal. But I didn't pass it to hobbin. I passed it to whoever's on the other side of him. I think it was more and that's who I was passing to and the game was like actually you know what because Hobbins offside will pass to him instead. Alright, that's half time. Okay, good. 1-0 half time. We're still going out of the competition as we need another goal, but we're close. And Inter beating United. Wow, okay. Alright, change formation. Uh, we've taken off coin for Flores and we've gone back to our trusty 4-2-3-1. Huh? What? What the fuck happened there? That's just EA bullshit just knocked me out of this game. I've been knocked out of this tournament. Thanks to EA bullshit. What the fuck happened there? Right here, I press clear. And then it just... What? Oh, I hate this game. We should not have conceded. It's just so scripted, for fuck's sake. It's just so obvious that we were going to concede there. Like, I said to clear it, and instead it just goes through his fucking leg. This is why I say collision isn't a thing in FIFA. It's only when it wants there to be collision after it's collision. Right, that's that's it. I'm, I'm finished. Fucking finished. Fuck this game. Fuck this game. We did not deserve to get knocked out there. That's just EA just deciding that we're going to lose. That's all that was. EA just decided, hey, uh, fuck you. What a load of shite. And what a shit way to end the episode as well. Well, it's the end of episode two. It was god fucking awful.